So, back again, second time this week. Uh, another review. Get this off my head. Uh, there we go. Another review. This time it's going to be Shotgun None by Harrison Phillips. Uh, it's my first read by Harrison Phillips, who I didn't even know was English. Uh, which was a complete fuck, mind fuck. I uh, always thought he was American for some reason. Uh, but yeah, it's my first read by him. And uh, uh, <coughs> I've excused the face, I'm really tired. And the voice uh, channeling Barry White tonight. But um, yeah, Har uh, well, uh, Harrison Phillips, Shotgun Nun. It's the story of Sister Eloise, a nun, obviously, who uh, suffers a really, really brutal fucking attack. Uh, while she's in a church after a night out giving uh, soup to the homeless. Her and uh, a young priest and an older priest. I need a young priest and an old priest. The power of Christ compels me. Yeah, a young priest and an old priest. Uh, and uh, there's a really brutal attack. Really full-on brutal. Uh, uh, and she... Uh, Kind of loses her faith a bit, as you would, I would imagine, because of what happens. But, uh, going in with spoilers now, so if you don't want to know what happens, just turn off. Uh, then gets a visitation from Jesus, uh, who basically tells her to go and fucking kill all these motherfuckers that motherfucking fucked with her, because they deserve it. Uh, and the sooner she kills them, the sooner they can suffer fucking agonising torture for the rest of time in hell. Which seems fair, because she goes through some real bad stuff. Uh, and and what the book's about is, if it was a film, it'd be an exploitation film. Uh, I'm a massive fan of exploitation films. Trip with Teacher, uh, it's one of my favourites. Uh, House at the Edge of the Park. So many films like that. Uh, there's a film with David Hess. <laughs> They've all got David Hess. He's just a fucking bad man. Uh, where he is like a hitchhiker. That's another good one. Another exploitation. Great, uh, great films. Just fuck. I think there's Dennis Weaver in that one as well. Great films. Uh, and this is what that felt like. It felt very exploitive. Very sleazy. I like sleazy. It felt very grindhouse and very real and yeah. And that's that's my thing. Uh I fucking loved it. Absolutely loved it. It completely I'm getting for an entire interview that sound blew my mind. It's completely fucked my brain up, man. It's my, <laughs> I'm still going with it. It's a yeah, it's an amazing book. Uh the dialogue in it is spot on. Really, really good. The violence is is so well fucking described, and so violent. It's 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 fucking disgusting. But written well. The attack on Sister Eloise is as brutal as fuck. It really is. Really brutal. Kind of set me in mind of uh the rape of the nun in a. Uh, the Harvey Keitel Bad Lieutenant, which was 97, 98, I'm thinking. Need to check that. But yeah, the rape of the nun in that, which is pivotal to the to the story, kind of set me in mind a bit of, of reading about uh, what happens to Sister Eloise made me think of that, and it's so well written. But it, it, despite the stuff that happens, it didn't feel dirty. Like in a, uh, it was handled really well, I think, and 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 I just love everything about this book. Uh, the cover's fucking amazing. I don't know who does the cover, and the cover of the second one, which I've just started reading about, about fifty percent of the way through reading that, that's just fucking amazing as well. And even more brutal, if possible. But yeah, but uh, the cover's amazing. The story's amazing. The characters were amazing. Uh, I can't really fault anything about. It. I don't go into books looking for faults. I always go, hmm. Can I fault it? I, I, I couldn't fault this if I wanted to. It's so good. Uh, I would love it to have been longer. That's always uh, 
common complaint I get. <laughs> would like to have been longer. Sorry. Yeah, uh, yeah. But it was an amazing, amazing book. Uh, but yeah, it was probably the perfect length actually for what it was. It, it was really, really the pace was perfect. Everything was just fucking spot on. So thumbs up, Harrison. Uh, yeah, you fucking done well, man. Really, really impressed. Really enjoying the book too, uh, and can't wait to read more of your stuff. Uh, apologize, apologize, apologies to everyone for having a top on this. It's, it's, it's I'm fucking really warm. I think I'm going through the menopause. Uh, if that's a thing, I'm just hot and. But yeah, but yeah. So if you haven't read Shotgun, then get on it. It's fucking amazing. You need to read it. Uh, I need, I need more people to speak about it with. It's just, it's just fucking everything. Really, really is great. And Harrison's just a fucking huge talent. Uh, and he's British as well, so that's even better. So yeah, go read it. Thank you. Good night.